Major development concerning the crisis at the Capitol. The South Florida man who led the far right group, the Proud Boys, now facing conspiracy charges after he's arrested in connection to the attack. CBS 4's Brooke Schaefer is live from outside his Miami home to explain all of this. He was taken into custody, broke in a pre dawn raid. Yeah, and Kendace and Maribel, we actually spoke with his mother. She said she thought it was overkill. The FBI showed up here at his home early in the morning with guns drawn. FBI, to the door. Before the sun came up yesterday morning, the FBI was at the door of 38-year-old Henry or Enrique Tario, the former leader of the Proud Boys. FBI. The FBI surrounded his home on the 5700 block of Northwest 2nd Street in Miami. Tario came out making a peace sign gesture. Then he was placed in handcuffs. He's been indicted on charges related to the January 6th Capitol insurrection, including conspiracy, obstructing an official proceeding, assault, and destruction of government property. I'm not going to worry about people that they're only worry in life is to be reelected. Tario was interviewed by CNN last year, shortly after the insurrection. He had this to say about members of Congress. I'm not going to cry about a group of people that don't give a crap about their constituents. I'm not going to I'm not going to sympathize with them. Although he's not accused of physically taking part in the breach of the Capitol, the indictment says he helped plan, direct, and lead other members, and even claimed credit on social media in an encrypted chat room. Tario is expected back in court at the end of the week. I'm live in Miami, Brooke Schaefer, CBS4, this morning.